think the uh, people inside will be uh, upset by some man screaming outside into their church. Objection calls the speculation. David Miscavige beats his staff! When I say things like, you deserve a living wage, how's that supposed to upset them? Was it easy? You deserve a living wage. Can you answer my question? So you, you have no intention of, dis of upsetting anyone when you yell at them? I want to educate people. So when you say, is it an education to tell someone, run away, you coward? You're all about to run inside! Would that be an educational speech? Objection calls speculation. Answer. Lex Foundation. Debbie Cook thought it was the right thing to do. Can, Mr. Meyer, can you answer my question? When you say, run away, you cowards, would that be educational? Objection calls for speculation. Educational would be uh, David Miscavige. No, answer staff. my question. You're answering, you're asking, give me a different question. Are all, when you say to people, run away, you're all cowards, would that, is that an educational statement? Is that what you're saying? Ob objection lacks foundation. And you put up on YouTube, in fact, uh, a video of the incident. Yes, and when I shouted at those... Isn't that correct? Yes, I put it up, yes. Scientology protesters interrupt horse-based IAS ceremony in L.A.? Yes. And IAS stands for International Association of Scientologists? Yes. Did you write that title? Yes. And you posted the video on YouTube? Yes. Now, I just want to play this for you. Created by you? Yes. And Mr. Choquette? Created? No. Was Ms. Did Mr. Choquette video part of that also? No. That was all your video? Of the location. That whole video was, was recorded by you? Did I? No. Who else recorded it? Whoever shot that horseman. The video that you posted on the internet? Yes. Was that recorded only by you? No. Who else? The Church of Scientology created part of it. Okay, the first part of it, you took off some promotional? Yes. Mm -hmm. so, you, so you copied off a Church of Scientology promotional? Yes. The first part of it. Dauntless, defiant, and resolute. And the rest of it, of the incident when you and Choquette were at the church there on our Unhubbard Way, was that all shot by you? Yes. Did Mr. Choquette video part of it also? Do you know mm. if he did a video? Objection, close to speculation. I don't know. It appeared that you uh, broke up the gathering that was there, didn't it? Where is Heber Jen? Objection, calls to speculation. The gathering broke up when you yelled at the people, right? Objection. Answer. The video speaks for itself. Yes. You saw what happened. <laughs> Your orgs are empty! Warriors! Are you supposed to be defiant? You are the wimpiest people I've ever seen! You're all about to run inside! Go ahead, run inside, Mr. Defiant! Where's Shelly Miscavige? Where is Heber Gents? Where are the missing Scientologists? David Miscavige is sleeping with Larissa Stukenbrook! You should be ashamed to be Scientologist! Where is Shelly Miscavige? Was it your intention to disrupt the gathering? That's what protests do, in turbulation, not disruption, in turbulation. And how would you define in turbulation? In turbulation is the creation of turbulence. To upset people? Could we generically say in turbulation would be to upset someone? Uh, well, LRH's definition of in turbulation is the creation of turbulence. My definition might be that in turbulation is more than annoying, but it's, it's less than harassment. And that's what you were intending to do? In turbulate and to break up the, the gathering of Scientologists. Objection asked and answered. Correct? Mm. What he said. Part of your purpose was to break up the gathering of Scientologists and make them run inside. Objection calls to speculation. You can answer. The video speaks for itself. 
Yes, exactly. Answer the question or refuse to answer it? I refuse to answer because the answer is self-evident. Are you dauntless and defiant, lady? Take a picture of me and I will sue your ass. Oh, I have got you on film, honey. You're on high definition. We're going to put you on the internet, honey. You and your idiotic little torch. Ooh, are we playing dress up for the Scientologist today? Why don't you use your OT powers to make us go away? Well, that's not an appropriate objection to a question, is that the answer is self-evident. As I understand it, the self-evidence of it is that you intended to break up the gathering, am I correct? We intended to protest. That's not what I asked you. Did you intend to break up the group of people, yes or no? Objection asked and answered. You apparently are not getting the answer you want, Mr. Moxham, but that doesn't mean you have to keep asking the same question. Answer. Objection asked and answered. Mr. Berry, asked and answered is not a, uh, a recognized... Blah, 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 blah. Objection. It's not an objection, any rules of evidence. Uh, it's, a, it's, it's a way to coach someone, perhaps, to avoid answering a question you don't want them to answer, but it's not an appropriate objection. Neither it is, now, a, is it appropriate, Mr. Moxon, to keep asking I wanna, the same I wanna, question. I don't want to argue with you, Mr. Barron. Thank you. When you said you all you people are about to run away, what did you mean by that? You're all about to run inside! I meant that they were not dauntless and defiant. And that they were about to leave their gathering and run inside the church? Yes. Because you were out there yelling at them, right? Objection calls to speculation. We were tipped off by a spy inside Scientology who told us about this IAS course-related event. So thanks for making this possible, mystery person. Protester and non-orange and I take two entire minutes to clear the street. I'll run Hubbard Way of Scientologists. Did you write that text? Yes, I did. And this is your YouTube site, The End of Scientology? Yes. In fact, were you tipped off by a by a, quote, spy inside Scientology who told you about the uh, event? No. You just made that up? Yes. Mr. Moxon, it's nearly an hour and there's not been one question about anything to do with Gilman Hot Springs, Hammett, or Mr. Choquette's incident that is the basis of this lawsuit. You're trespassing. Hey, hey, hey! Trespassing. You're under arrest for trespassing. No, no. Trespassing. You're under arrest for trespassing. Hey, guys! You're under arrest for trespassing! How did you know this event was taking place? I didn't. Just a, a random raid? Yes. Did Mr. Choquette seem to uh, enjoy that incident of the, uh, what you call the Scientology protesters interrupt horse-based IAS ceremony? Yes. You little coward! Even oh! The horses ran off. <laughs> Even the horses ran off. <laughs> Man, we couldn't have scored better. Did you feel it was a successful raid? Yes. Did he feel it was a successful raid? Yes. Did it, did it matter to you that the uh, church's ceremony, IS ceremony, was broken up? Yes. How so? Because it was a pep rally, not a ceremony. And we wanted to let those people know what's going on. It was a very educational moment for them if they didn't know that David Miscavige beats his staff was all an attempt to educate them. Greetings, my fellow crusaders. You are one of us, dauntless, defiant. And to demonstrate to them that they are not dauntless and defiant. You want them to know that they're not dauntless and they're not defiant because... Of their they, behavior. Because they ran away when you yelled at them? They could have debated.